Well, I would say that, uh, as you have explained before, there are many international institutions that uh, have stated that uh, Venezuelan elections are reliable. There is no doubt there are uh, transparent and competitive elections. So uh, I think it's important, uh, since the media and some political actors are portraying a complete different scene, a complete different image of the Venezuelan elections, to go there to see if there are irregularities and then uh, report on those irregularities, but also raise our voice as international observers if these elections are legitimate, reliable, and transparent. So I think it's uh, very important the role that uh, we will have to uh, develop over Venezuela since there is uh, clearly a propaganda continuous attack against Venezuela. Now, Fernando, where you live in Quito, since you're talking about propaganda, what do you make of the media representation of Venezuela's elections and of the political situation in Venezuela overall? Yeah, well, uh, in a nutshell, I would say that uh, right now the Venezuelan elections are portrayed in the media as a complete show and non-transparent and illegal elections. You, you see that uh, normally they picture first Maduro not as a democratic uh, elected president, but uh, clearly and without no uh, restrictions they uh, call him and refer to him as a dictator, but also uh, the rest of the candidates who have nothing to do with the Chavismo and they come from the opposition side, they are also portrayed as Chavistas in order to uh, picture these elections as a show. So uh, I would say that that's a very responsible uh, representation of Venezuela in the media right now.